Hello friends, in this video, we prove that E is irrational. The proof we are going to see in this video is by the method of contradiction. So we assume E to be rational, that is E equals P over Q, where P and Q are positive integers. Now let me define Sn to be summation 1 over n factorial, 1 over k factorial, k goes from 0 to n. Now note that e minus sn is equal to 1 over n plus 1 factorial plus 1 over n plus 2 factorial plus dot dot dot. Um, this is strictly less than 1 over n plus 1 factorial times 1 plus 1 over n plus 1 plus 1 over n plus 1 square plus dot dot dot. Now this is a geometric series. So that is equal to 1 over n plus 1 factorial times this is a geometric series with common ratio 1 over n plus 1. So this is same as 1 divided by 1 minus 1 over n plus 1 which becomes 1 over n plus 1 factorial times 1 over n plus 1 minus 1 which is n by n plus 1. So here we get n factorial. So this is 1 over n times n factorial. Now note that we have obtained 0 is less than e minus sn which is less than 1 over n factorial times n. Now this implies 0 is less than n factorial times e minus sn is less than 1 over n. Now Now we take n equals q, which implies 0 is less than q factorial times e minus sq is less than 1 over q. Now, by our assumption, q factorial times e is an integer. Since we had assumed e equals p over q. And q factorial sq is nothing but q factorial times 1 plus 1 plus 1 over 2 factorial plus dot dot dot. So on up to 1 over q factorial. Which is again an integer. So this term is an integer. This is a contradiction since what this implies is that if we take q equals 2, this would imply there exists an integer between 0 and 1 by 2 which is a contradiction and hence our initial assumption that e is rational is wrong there are multiple proofs of this statement please feel free to comment down below which of the proofs is your favorite proof thank you